Guys, I think today we have a passenger in the plaid. Let's take a look and see what the heck is this? No clue. Guys, welcome back to the channel, and today we have something exciting, and that is the Plaid is headed back to All Set Auto, and today we have this carbon fiber apron that they will be installing and correcting some things going on with the wrap. So we are headed over to All Set Auto this morning on a Thursday. We will update you guys as we get to All Set Auto. All right, guys, we are pulling up at All Set Auto in Jacksonville, Florida, and we are going to go in and see how those guys have been doing and uh, deliver the car to them and see what they're going to do to it next. It might be a surprise right here next to me. And that might be, I don't know who that was. That might be Julie. Let's go find out. Everybody, we are back at All Set Auto in Jacksonville, and we're taking a look at what they're doing now, and they are incredibly busy in here. And back here on the table, they have the carbon fiber front apron from T-Sport line, and they're gonna be putting that on for me as a favor. And then taking a look at some of the things on the wrap that we need to get corrected. So we will update you guys with some live video from getting the front apron installed at All Set Auto.
All right, we're back at All Set Auto. It's been a day or so since we dropped the car off to get the front apron put in. These guys are working hard on that. Is that a Model X? Uh, Model Y. Model Y right there. And then if we take a look over here at the car, we can see that we got the front apron installed. That matte carbon fiber apron looks so good on the front and it fits absolutely perfectly. And that is why we came here and they did such a good job putting that thing on. And check out how the car looks under the lights. It looks so good. Now we gotta drive it in the rain, maybe, for the second time ever. But hey, this thing came out so good. These guys treat the car like it's their own. And they've got a whole shop full here, so they know they're doing something right if people want to bring their cars here. And then we got the shop puppy over here, chilling. But yeah, guys, so we're gonna take this car home, throw it in the garage, never drive it again. And uh, that's it, that's it, it's the end of life. 600 miles, it's retired. Guys, we just picked up the car from All Set Auto in Jacksonville. Now turn right onto Phillips Highway. I'm about to, girl. But um, yeah, we picked the car up. They put the front apron on, fixed a few little minor issues with the wrap, which is normal. We did our two week checkup and now we are headed home with the car. Once we get there, we will give a little bit of a final view of the awesome carbon fiber front apron installed right on the 2023 Tesla Model S plaid looking so fly and so hot and we'll talk to you guys here shortly once we get back to the house guys back in the supercar street racing garage and we are taking a look at the 2023 Tesla Model S plaid and how it sits right here in the current state so the exterior mods are almost done Thanks for ruining my shot. The carbon fiber camera covers are not done and I just figured out that they left out. They forgot that part right there. They missed this issue with the wrap, but I will let them know. So yeah, the car is exterior almost done. We're waiting for the carbon fiber mirror covers and here is a look at the front apron installed so nicely on the plaid and it came out really good as you can see here the fitment this is the t-sport line front apron fitting so perfectly on the plaid and like i was saying earlier the only thing left to do now is the carbon fiber mirror caps and i'm really really considering the carbon fiber rear splitter, which is kind of an install pain. You have to take off the back bumper and all that, but it might be something worth checking out. And it looks like the car is charging right now. And it's at 79% and still going two hours left. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the channel today with the carbon fiber apron, guys. So hyped. Hype train was loaded and ready to go today for supercar straight racing. And I remind you to always please click through the links in our videos for merchandise in the description because we get a dollar or two here and there to keep the channel going and pay for this thing and this thing. And it doesn't have to be what you're actually buying. You can buy anything thing through any of my links. I'm having trouble talking and that will help us so greatly on the channel. And we appreciate you guys and love you guys. And we will see you soon on Supercar Street Racing.